All right, hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome back to Exmorph Defense. So we got one upgrade. Oh, so it, it wiped my progress. Well, that's fine. So let's just get those bombs, and let's go get the. We'll get the bombs. We'll get the other stuff. I mean, interesting about the charged weapons, but honestly, I really like the the just basic line shot that I have. Another core is approaching landing at the designated location. Synchronization with the first core is correct. Geodetic matrix construction in progress. This core is one of the first three that are necessary to the planet's assimilation process. We are detecting a sizable enemy air force presence. Prepare to defend the harvester core. The aliens are invading Great Britain. After the first encounter in South Africa, I've been called upon by the United Nations Security Council to coordinate defense efforts around the globe. Let's send these aliens back where they came from. I'm dispatching a quick assault recon to the castle before we prepare the main assault force. Uh, let's see, so I only have a couple of towers here. Makes this a bit rough. Uh... Let's see. Yeah, I'd like to get more of these. It's kind of hard to do so. i just move that right there. It's like the world's smallest fence, but I'll take it. Okay. Okay, and I'm just gonna have to... Wait, can I just have one of these guys, like, right here? No, you have to have two. You can't just have one block the entire road. Does that even work? Yeah, I guess they just passed... Wait, what? Oh... Yeah, okay, so I can't, uh, I can't block this at all. I was really hoping that I could funnel them all through this, like, central area, but it doesn't look like there's actually any, um... It doesn't look like there's any way through. I'm trying to decide on this one, because we can have them go this, but it's probably best that I have them loop through here. Because, again, my goal is to delay as long as possible. Hmm. There's got to be a way I can do this. I guess if I just move it here. Okay, it's not perfect. Eventually, I'll... Uh, I'd like to have... Well, could I? Maybe... Can I do this? Yeah, it's perfect. Okay. Well, it's almost perfect. For now, though, it's probably better. Here, I'm gonna... I'm gonna move this sucker back. I just wanna see... which route they take. You know what? This is, this is probably better. Eventually, I will put a third one here, so they have to go up and around, as well. Because the more I can delay, the better. Hopefully that'll delay it while the other side gets taken care of. We also have to worry about air defense here. Light ground forces on site. Commencing attack. Jet fighters in the zone. Attacking the aliens. He did say that there was going to be quite a lot of air units. I'll, I'll work on it in a second. Light ground recon team moving towards alien base. Over. Okay. Let's just kind of keep blasting them. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, I don't, I don't even know how to switch gun types here. Which is actually, like, a legit concern. Okay. Yee. I'm just gonna go around. 
worry about that. Uh, there is still one more jet, but we're golden. Okay, cool. Pick all these up. Air support attacking aliens. Okay. We're good. We're good. There's mild amounts of concern. I, I like the fact that this is a twin stick shooter. Don't get me wrong. Uh, well, not quite t twin stick shooter. I'm not entirely sure what classification I'd want to throw at this. But at the Jet same time, ZTA, uh, still wish there was more of a focus on tower defense. Like, I really liked in Sanctum how, yeah, you had to use the towers and such to, uh... Oh, that's interesting. You can get the jet fighters to just check out. Okay, that's cool. Assault helicopters entering the zone. We'll give them hell. Warning. Incoming. Surprise attack from the air. We are raising an anti-air defense tower to help you. The aliens right. are morphing their towers. They built some kind of AA defense that's ripping us to shreds. Humans are preparing multiple air unit formations for an airstrike. We recommend setting up anti-air defense towers. It appears that these extraterrestrials can morph their structures to suit their purpose. I'm designating the aliens, codename Xmorph. Okay, so if I put that right there, and one more right here, that'll force them to take the long way around. Cool. Uh, so next up, let's get up here. We already have a tower down, so that actually makes us really easy. Again, my usual strategy is just to waste as much time as possible while, while my enemies try and uh, try and get through. Wonder if you could actually like maze them more effectively closer in. I don't know. Well, either way, I think this is probably the best I'm going to get. I've got helicopter squadrons are approaching the target. Not much else. Direct your attack at the alien core. Tank brigades will support the assault. Air support, your location, one minute. So it looks like the, uh... It looks like the airplanes will just straight up disengage. Assault helicopters ready. On course to alien base. Hey, will these guys shoot at me? No, it doesn't look like it. Well, that's kind of a plus. I'll have to worry about the other side in a second. I should really figure out how to equip uh, that bomb, though. How do I do it? Uh, let's do help and options. Unless I didn't buy it. Uh, do we want help and... Okay, weapons and shooting. Charge weapons, ghost mode, building towers, laser fences, blocking, last path, moving and selling towers, upgrading towers, no, that's the same thing, destructible environment, losing towers, cooperative mode resources, hold tags, no, hollow tags, do controls, ah, Q and E. Okay. Just one click from alien base. Commencing attack. Here's support yeah. ready. We've got your back. Over. This part was not the uh, the most defined, but that's okay. Because now I've now I've got some capability for damage. Uh oh, missed one. Barely, barely missed one. Okay, so it looks like the helicopters. Oops. It looks like the helicopters aren't aren't getting past. Nope. That's, that's what I'm looking for. That's good. And yeah, it looks like the AA towers are doing a great job of taking out the, the helis. That's good. Was worried about that. Oh, thank you. Thank you, bombs. Yeah, bombs probably would have been more useful than artillery. 
on the uh, last round. I like the artillery, we just... They don't have enough oomph. Oh. Oh, the... The bomber craft does not have a charge... Uh, does not have the same charge move. I might have to unlock it. I will ETA three seconds. keep that in mind. I really wish the scrap would actually last longer. It would be cool if that was an upgrade. Oops. Messed that up. Well, I sorta of did, I sorta of didn't. I'm just gonna let my, my towers take out the planes. I could fight them myself, but I don't mind that much. Oh, hi. Intelligence reports that the metal covering the ground is a highly advanced method of gathering resources and producing energy. Let's destroy this surface before it grows any bigger. I'm sending out bombers to deal with this. Sparrow 1, Tango in Killbox Alpha 3. Commencing bombardment. Over. surface disappears after an alien tower is destroyed. Acknowledged. We're sending more bombers against their primary structure. All alien towers along the flight path are targets of opportunity. Humans are trying to destroy our towers, but the assimilation technology allows us to easily reclaim and rebuild them. However, try not to build defense towers directly under enemy bomber flight paths. You might not have enough time to rebuild them during combat. Okay, so we got a bomber path coming through. This is an anti-air. That's a regular one. Are both of these? No, this is. these are just regular flyers. Okay. I think for peace of mind, I'm going to go with a, a second uh, anti-air tower right here. That way we have two. And... Um, trying to decide where's the best place to put a second anti-air tower. I guess just right here would probably do the trick. Okay, after this, we just need damage. Is there any way that I can uh, force these guys to take any more cir circuitous paths? Because you guys know me. Is, that is my main manner of defense. Just just kill time. Actually, if I put this here... Ah, I was really hoping I could... I was really hoping I could... Uh, Block him further. Well, that's okay. Yeah, this is that's a nicely long and annoying route, and I don't have anything else. Bombers entering danger zone. On route to release payload on alien structures. Okay, so we got we do have bombers. Oh, the bombers will shoot back. There's no way this thing would be flying after all that damage. Assault helicopters one click away from alien base. Commencing attack. Yeah, there's no way. Well, are we golden? Or do I have to babysit? Looks like I have to babysit. Okay. I'll babysit it a bit more. That should be good enough. I hope. Bomber looks like it. We'll looks like down. it is. Okay. I don't. I don't entirely know if if that was like overkill, but Assault I mean, peace of mind is super important. Oh, hello. 
I really wish there was like a collector tower that I could just get. Oh, that'd be amazing. Because, yeah, a, just like a collector tower, or like an upgrade that makes my towers, uh, my towers themselves collect scrap would be, like, super awesome. Oh, well. Yeah, looking at all of these models, somebody had, uh, somebody had mentioned, oh, shit. Uh, somebody had mentioned, uh, that, like, some Command & Conquer devs must have, must have worked on this. I'm inclined to believe that's true. Like, I can't imagine this was not worked on, in part, by, like, Command & Conquer developers. We're taking heavy alien fire. This is, this is way too... Like, the units are so Command & conquer it's... Air support, experiencing heavy losses. Kind of ridiculous. Gunships attacking the alien. And, like, it actually makes me really want these devs to, uh, to make, like, a proper RTS. Because, it, I mean, the environments, it would not take much to just repurpose every single model here. Air support ready. We've got your back. Over. It would not take much effort at all to repurpose this entire game effectively as a Command & Conquer, uh, clone. And, I mean, hell, look at them. They, they look really nice. Okay, so we're probably in the clear there. So we've got some jerkish dudes coming along this way, but I'm fine. I do I have to worry about this side? No, I don't. But I do have to worry about retrieving my money from all of them. Hell yeah. Wanna keep shooting at me? Thank you. Love them when they just shoot at me. Makes my life easier. Okay, uh, it's just this one last guy. Gimme, give gimme. Give the bomber strike has failed. We'll be sending transport helicopters in the next wave. They will drop tanks directly in the village. Watch out for air transports carrying ground units. They can fly past some of our defenses. I mean, that's not really a problem. And these guys aren't going to make it. Probably. Doesn't look like we've got any more bombers, though. So really what we need are just straight up actual defenses. I'm trying to see if there's anything better I can do. Now really I just need to, to put some towers. I really can't put towers in here. Ah, that sucks. Because that's like the perfect spot for it. I'm going to move these guys over here. Because, yeah, blocking this is necessary, but these towers are kind of completely useless. Now, is there a better location to put towers? The answer is not really. Because we might have some land here. That's a lot, actually. So we effectively need to just put all guns on bear, like, right here. Well. Sure, why not? Because the other, the other side is heavily fortified. I hope my towers don't have to worry about shooting through each other. Air transport on site. Preparing delivery. Stand by for deployment. We need flamethrower tanks and a couple other things. So the the helicopters are literally just carrying the tanks. Okay. I was expecting that they'd have multiple, you know, uh, command and conquer style, but they they don't. Well, that makes it easy enough. And yeah, this. This looks like Assault helicopters one click from alien base commencing attack. Looks like we're all golden there. Everything is good. There's so much scrap just coming off of these helicopters. 
so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep grabbing it. We do have the um, we do have the other landing points that I should probably. Five seconds. Confirming drop zone visual. I'm gonna try. There we go. Yeah, if I can. Uh... Ow. If I can hamper that a little bit, I Arms think I will be happy. Okay. Hurts. Hurts real bad. Okay, so it looks like my whole mess of towers uh, is doing their job more than well enough. I was worried about that for a second. Uh, and it looks like I might want a, another anti-air right here. Doing some of the job, but not enough of it. Because, yeah, if I can uh, prevent these guys from even landing, that'd be great. Uh-oh. We actually have some coming in. And by some, I mean, like, a small handful. So I'll have to fortify both sides a little bit more, but that's fine. Yeah, my towers are actually managing to do this. Oh, look at that. Look at those sweet bits. Uh-oh. No. You're not you're not actually getting in here. That is that is a no no fly zone. Yeah, so I think I might replace the artillery towers with flamethrowers. Uh just as a replace my my artillery towers with the with flamethrowers just because it feels like the artillery tower the artillery towers are kind of pointless. Uh, I haven't been using them that much, but they just seem to do a bunch of damage to like under heavy fire. single targets. What I want is just something that can hit a bunch of guys at once, maybe. Don't Air know. Support engaging hostiles. Hello. It's a fair amount of air support, actually. I might also pick up just the missiles. Maybe? I don't know. I feel like missiles... Complicated our unit's paths to their base. It will take too long for them to get there. I'm authorizing the destruction of all bridges in the combat area. This will alter the alien defense plans. Commencing bombardment of the western bridges. Huh. This will really mess me up, actually. It would have been funny if I could predict the this and have a bunch of AA in the area. And area. I wonder if I could have actually clustered a bunch of anti-air in that specific location. It'd be pretty funny if I just like automatically destroyed these, but it, it looks like these these uh, bombers are severely improved, well, ex extremely improved. Well. I guess I'm just going to sell every tower that I have and we are going to rethink this entire setup as soon as we know what we're up against. Fantastic. This will complicate things for the aliens and make matters easier for us. Prepare the next assault wave. Humans managed to destroy all bridges for the surprise airstrike. Check the layout of all enemy paths. Some of them may have changed. Adjust your defenses accordingly. Okay, I'm just gonna keep selling these. Because some of these things we just do not need. Looks like we don't have to worry about like some kind of weird arbitrary money cap. cap. Okay. Wish the map had actually changed as a result of this. So... That works. These bridges are all dead. I mean, nice part is we're still going to force them to come through kind of the same area. I'd be wonderful like, if I could make a ramp between. Okay. Well. Impossible. It's not ideal. But like this works.
Okay, because, yeah, they'll still have to go through this entire lengthy squiggle. Main group that I'm worried about is these guys. They have the shortest possible path, from what I can see. Well, almost shortest. There's a whole castle here. Okay, that, that helps. Okay, so we got bombers coming through. Yeah, these these look like bombers. Let's see. So we just want three anti-air. That should be enough to prevent any bomber from coming through. And this is probably fine. I mean, it says 60 helicopters. They tend to come in sets of three, so I probably don't need to worry about it there. These guys. Well, I mean, when in doubt... Probably a bunch right there. And... Yeah, we don't have any bridges left in this area. Impossible. I don't know if we have to worry about line of sight at all. But I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna cram these areas full of towers. Okay. So we got five towers left. Where do I want to put them? It would be great if I could put them on top of the castle, but I can't. Uh, let's see. I could kind of go all in on this location. I'll just leave an extra tower there in case I need to... In case I need to um, uh, make another AA tower. Okay, so it's not pretty. It's mostly just super extensive. Oh, well, it's, it's super excessive. I guess we did have this, like, whole area up here that I could have mazed them through. It just seems... comes off as kind of pointless. Tank Brigade reporting. Leading assault. Because, like... I could. But I don't... I don't think it would actually, like, help me. It would just slow them down. I don't really need them to be slowed considerably here. Heavy column destroyed. Okay, this. so this group needs more towers. I don't have any more. Okay, let's fix this. This area is kind of the money maker. Uh oh. Okay. So it looks like the bombers can kind of get by. They kind of can't. Silly cursor getting kind of in the way. Okay. I don't have much to work from here. Work from, work with. I think we're okay. These guys haven't even hit the meat of my defenses, which is good. And these guys are getting crushed by it. That's good. Make me more money. I need more towers. More towers. Especially coming off the helicopter section. Yeah, so I think what I'm going to do is just... Pile... Uh, towers into this section. Yeah, apparently three anti-air air is not enough. I was really expecting, uh... I was really expecting three anti-air towers to be enough for the bombers, but looks like I was very much incorrect. Oh, that's okay. Alright, let's grab all this scrap. Is this, is this it? Actually, it looks like this is the end of this mission.
I gotta remember to bait them. Because the air support will disappear if I'm... If I'm... Uh, if I, like, switch back into ghost mode. So we want to keep them around Prepare for as long as possible. Final assault. We're attacking with all the forces at our disposal. Okay. Our scanners are showing that the final attack is incoming. Survive this assault wave, and the harvester will be safe. So we do have to worry about these guys right here. Well, that's actually the easiest to deal with. These guys aren't blocking anything. I just gotta... Put them where they're not going to get hit. Alright. So we do have to worry about... We have to worry about... Air coming through here. Okay. Well... I don't think I'm going to get any more prepped than this. Forces Alpha, Charlie, Tango. Commence attack from the north. I say again, attack from the north. Might as well see what I can get my hands on. Okay. So the bombers are arguably the most dangerous thing that I've got to have... that I have to deal with here. So I'm going to probably focus on them. That right side is scary, though. I did put more AO A A A here, right? Might not have actually. Might be just the mercy of my my towers taking everything out for me. It's busy. Well, I guess I'm here to deal with it too. Yeah. Ooh. This is bad. Uh, I took some hits there. Let's see if I can upgrade you to anti-air. Okay. So my towers can take it out as long as we don't have to worry about um, tanks in the way. This gets hairy bad. Okay, last bomber coming through in a second. I actually thought these were just going to be regular enemies. But we're fine. just grab all that I can and yep okay consider getting another anti-air here it looks like even three towers wasn't enough though it it has left them in a state of uh, distress I guess okay let's line this up ships attacking the alien and we're golden. Okay, let's uh, switch to bomber mode. We probably need the extra. We need the extra damage here. Okay, pick up cash. Pick up cash. Let's see. We've still got more coming in, probably. Do we? Here's I don't know. Coming up in a minute. I actually, I don't know. We This might be the end of it. I see, like, air support coming in, but that's that's the extent of it. We might be golden. Just kind of that stressful initial wave, and then we're... We have nothing else to worry about. Okay. That, that'd be good. That'd be nice. A lot of just schmutz on the ground. Damn it. The aliens have massacred our elite assault squads. We've lost this battle. We're ceasing all attacks for the time being. I say again, cease all attacks. There we go. Congratulations. Human forces have been obliterated. We can now proceed with expanding the core. Each core that is expanded on the surface increases our energy potential on this planet. This allows us to use more technologies. Proceed to the next operation site. 
Well, we made it. I mean, there kind of wasn't actually that much of a uh, concern for it. We did take just a smidge of damage. Well, I'll take it. And it's not like it really matters. All right, so we've got Argentina. And... Okay, so Argentina has has bombers. Germany has a couple. Not so many, though. I don't, I don't know what the, the difference is. Threat? I... Eh. I just want to take a look at, like... No, it won't even tell me the mission parameters on these. Well, that's fine. Yeah, I just want to see. So I got the bombs. So Dark Matter Bomb is my... Is my charge up while I'm in this m mode. Probably not the most useful for what I'm doing, though. Wait, can I... Oh. I can actually get rid of these upgrades, if I so chose. I don't think I'm going to. So, I think I'm actually going to get rid of bombs. They were kind of helpful, but they're not, like, amazingly so. I really wish missiles would actually work against, uh... Ground targets, too, but no dice. Okay, so there's, there's the anti-air missile tower, the anti-air laser tower. I mean, I'd definitely go missile if I could. It's locked, though. That sucks. And I don't, I don't have any of these, but that's okay. I, I still wish the upgrade tree was, uh, was deeper than this. Oh well, not the end of the world. So I will see you guys in the next episode of Exmorph Defense, and as always, thanks for watching.